Hey everyone, welcome back to another video tutorial. Dusty here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to import Mogurt files. Sounds like yogurt, uh, but it's M O G R T, standing for Motion Graphics Templates, into Adobe Premiere Pro. Um, so there's a lot of cool things that you can do with Mogurt files, um, and that's how I'm going to refer to them uh, in this video. So as you can see over here on the right, you have the Essential Graphics panel. Uh, if I drag to the left here, I make that just a little bigger for you to see. Uh, the Essential Graphics is going to be where everything takes place. So if you cannot see the Essential Graphics panel there, let's just say that this panel was closed out within your Premiere uh, Pro workspace, go up to Window and then go down to where you see Essential Graphics. And then it should pop up wherever you have it designated. Um, as you can see uh, below here, I have some examples of said um, Mogurt files like this one here. This is an end card. So this is like a specific YouTube end card. So if we make this a little bigger here, uh, I imported this uh, Mogurt from a, a wonderful artist who made these. Uh, and these are just animated YouTube end cards. And then if we play them back here within Premiere Pro, you can see these are going to be the new end cards that I'm going to be using on my YouTube channel. Now, I haven't rendered any of this here yet, so it's kind of stalling out just a little bit here. But you can kind of get the point of what we're trying to do. We're trying to import the motion graphics template files into Premiere Pro for you to loot for you to use at any time now there's a couple of ways to do this i'm going to put in the description below if you want to import multiple mogurt files at a time uh, adobe makes it very difficult you can only import one at a time through the essential graphics panel i'm going to show you how to do that now but down in the description you're going to see on a pc and a mac how to locate the folder where you can go and just dump all of the files that way they'll show up directly into premiere pro even though i know that little trick um, I still do it this way most of the time just to make sure that I get every single one of the Mogurt files that I want imported into Premiere Pro. So over here on the Essential Graphics panel, you can see I have all of these different ones here. I can go to my YouTube subscribe one. So these here are like little bitty, uh, like lower thirds. Uh, you can see the little subscribe button here. So if I drag this Mogurt file over here, uh, if I play this back here, you can see this is going to be kind of like a, a little bit of a call to action. So if we play this back now, uh, on top of the video there, you'll see something here that has a like button, subscribe. These are just animated motion templates that you can go and adjust, change the size, change the color, just like you would any element within Adobe Premiere Pro. So I'm going to go ahead and remove those now from my project. All right, so if we go over here and if we want to import one, all we have to do is go over to uh, Browse, leave the Browse option available here, and then in the lower right-hand corner, it's going to say Install Motion Graphics Template. So if we click that button there in the lower right-hand corner, um, I have a couple of them uh, already available to me here, but as you can see, there's like over 20 of them. So I want to create a folder that just these kinetic title uh, motion graphic templates go into. So I'm going to go ahead and, and stop that process now and show you how to create a folder so you can kind of organize them like I have here. If you go up to the essential graphics panel here, right click on the three lines there beside the essential graphics name, you're going to see something that says manage additional folders. Now, as you can see here, these are the two folders that I have so far, YouTube end screens and YouTube subscribe uh, Mogurt files. Now, if I go here and click add, so I'm going to go ahead and click the add button here. I'm going to go and locate on my uh, computer hard drive here. I'm going to go ahead and find the ones that I want. Um, I want to go ahead and go to channel media. I'm going to go to kinetic titles version 1.4. I'm going to select folder. Now, whatever the name of that folder is, that's going to be the name of the folder within Premiere Pro. So now in order to add the files, all we need to do now that we have our folder created is go to the additional symbol here, click the addition symbol, select the Mogurt file that you want to import into Premiere Pro, and then click open, and that's going to import into the folder. Now I've imported them off of the uh, tutorial video here, just so you can see. Now you can see I have all of the different motion graphics templates here that I can just click and hold from within the essential graphics tab, just like so. And then if we've done this correctly, you'll see now some text coming up uh, there within my project. That's going to be the motion graphics template that I created, just like that there. Very simple, very easy. All of these different uh, Mogurt files can be edited. Um, so when you select them, you can see here under the effects controls panel, I can go here, I can actually change the scale so I can make this bigger, I can make it smaller. I can even go and change the color of this over here under the essential graphics panel. 
So if I go here, I can go down below, and if I want this to be a different color, I can select the color picker there, and then change that to a nice light green, and then as you can see, that's going to be changed to the green color there. Hopefully this was helpful. Uh, if it was, don't forget to like and subscribe. I really would appreciate it, and I will talk to you guys in the next video.